Uh, hello guys and uh, welcome to a second part of the uh, notification counter so in the previous video we have designed uh, uh, our uh, notification uh, counter icon here and uh, our activity main layout of course we have also added the uh, SVG file and now let's first uh, change the uh, ID of our text which will represent a number so let's say notification number and uh, inside our activity main layout uh, we're going to add the uh, ID for our include which is actually a bell XML file connected to it so uh, now that we have that we can create a new Java class okay and let's name this class um, notification co notification counter maybe okay click OK and uh, now in this class let's first uh, add a text view uh, here so let's set it to private uh, text view notification number which will represent the number from our bell XML let's add a constant for our uh, max number 99 so that will be the maximum number uh, our notification could handle and uh, next will be simple integer uh, notification number counter uh, the initial value will be 1 you can set it uh, set it to 0 but for now it will be 1 and now let's uh, create a constructor here and let's pass uh, view okay and inside our constructor here uh, I'm going to I'm going to uh, find the ID of our text view so uh, find okay so uh, view we need uh, uh, we need to pass here a view and then we can type uh, find view by ID because that's how it works okay now we have that and let's uh, pass our notification number ID which is a text view ID from a bell XML file and uh, now uh, let's uh, create a new method here public let's name it uh, public void uh, increase number there will be no parameters here so um, okay let's start by uh, saying a notification number plus plus uh, which will which uh, oh yeah sorry uh, notification number counter plus plus and uh, it will increase our integer by one every time we call this method and now in if block let's say if uh, notification number counter is uh, greater than uh, max number which is 99 uh, if it is greater than that we're going to log just log a simple message and uh, we're going to say maximum number reached and uh, the counter will will stop and uh, in else block we're going to uh, set the text for our text view so text view is notification number dot te uh, set text and we're going to set text to our uh, notification number counter which will be increased every time we uh, run this or call this method so we need to convert our integer to string uh, we're going to use string value of method and uh, I think it's fine now uh, we can proceed uh, back to our main activity class okay now we uh, let's uh, add a button here let's uh, also create a notification counter uh, object of our class uh, let's find the ID of our button from a main activity okay and now let's uh, initialize our uh, our new class by oh sorry a new notification counter and inside the parameter as you can see we need to pass a view and in this case view is a bell which is our uh, bell XML file okay uh, now sorry now uh, let's uh, 
add a button on click listener and inside this uh, on click listener we're, we're going to call uh, this uh, method for from our notification counter class increase number and uh, that's it so let's run our application to see how uh, how it works as you can see when we click uh, increase button this number will increase by one every time so i'll hold uh, down enter and it will increase the number to 99 and uh, after that it will stop and every time we press the button after that uh, the number will not increase so uh, that's pretty much it uh, i have uh, left you uh, homework homework uh, so uh, i want you to create a reset button and uh, when you uh, click that uh, reset button i want to reset uh, this counter from 99 to 0 or, or to 1 and maybe you can even add a, a function to to hide uh, this number and uh, card view every time you click a reset and every time you click you click increase you can show this card view and uh, text view and then increase the numbers so that's a little complex but uh, still a uh, good homework for you if you want to increase your skills and uh, that's it uh, thanks for watching guys um, like this video if you find it helpful of course and uh, see you in the next video